Wait. Oh, you're recording. I just got off the phone with the girl who loves you too. Said you're working on yourself. Is she helping with that too? Hello there, my peeps. What's up? Lost Parts and the Maid scene here. But today, I'm going to show you how to fly a drone like this. Like, alright. What are the specifications? This drone comes from JB Hi-Fi. It is a Zero X brand, and it's and the custom title is is Pulse. It's the perfect and ideal drone for most beginners. So if you're begin, so if you're just learning how to fly this, then this will be perfect for you because this costs about like fifty to eighty dollars at JB Hi-Fi, and it's normally found in Australia. So if you're in Australia, lucky. All right. Come here, let's get started. Before I show you how to fly these, fly this actual thing, I'm going to go into some details that might help you to troubleshoot for when, for when a problem occurs. Alright, let's go out here. First off, we're going to start with the rotors. Yes, the rotors. Now you see these little bulb things on them? You can take them off. And when you take them off, that's when you can replace your, ro that's when you can replace your rotors. So you see these rotors? These are what helps the things to fly. Should have mentioned that before, but what if you see these little feet? That's how it that's how it normally lands. Now, for these parts, people normally get mistaken with these and these parts going together. But really, this is the rotor rotor guard. So this goes onto the rotor to protect the rotor from when it crashes. Let's say for example this oh. Very messy, I know, but we're just going to keep and use it. Yeah, beep. That's the action it'll be. But if, but if it's been designed like this, uh, it doesn't make any add on much weight. So, but be careful with it. All right, now we're going to attach all these on. If I can. Okay, I've just connected. All the rotor guards this. But before you even start flying, where's the battery? So you're going to come here and I'm going to show you where the battery Okay. The battery will be here. This is the kind of battery that we'll be using to fly the drone. So we're going to unplug it. I've been ch charging this for a while. But the ideal charging time is about 30 to 90. 30 to 90 minutes with this charger. I do not remember what charger it is, so please do not ask me. I will reply in the comments when I find it. But this is the kind of ba battery I'm going to use. A 600 mAh. You can check the specifications for your stuff. Okay, so we've gotten our main objects. The drone, the remote, and the battery. So we're going to connect the battery in from the rear end, the behind. So just make sure that it's facing the right way. And you see this little part? It's going to go in on the God, I can't. right side. Right side, I forgot. So we're going to slip this in here. And it's, and it's plugged in, connected. Okay, now that just leaves us with the drone and the remote. Okay, so what you want to do is to. Stupid. So, what you want to do is to press this little button here. And you notice those little LED lights? There are two. There are two color variants red and blue. These indicate what. These indicate the front and the back. So basically, if this was like some sort of helicopter or something, this would be the window. All the coding and the wiring and the programming is inside this little bad boy. So we're just gonna, uh, yeah, put this here. And to turn on, and to turn on the remote, you have to, you have to turn on on the right side of the remote handle. I mean, this part isn't un is unnecessary, but you can use this if you want. So what you want to do is 
Floor to reset. Up. Down. That's a full reset. Now, once... Where'd it go? Once the lights stop blinking, that means it's connected. So... Okay, so... I have just... I have just positioned it. So now, what you're going to do is to turn is to turn this one at a five five o'clock angle and this little bit at a seven o'clock angle. You notice that? That just readies the rotors. Now one of the device. Don't put your fingers in it. It hurts. It may not cut you. But it still hurts. This is ideal for like 8 years old stuff, so do be careful. And you notice this little button? This little button? <laughs> this little button here. We're going to press that for it's release to the sky. That hurted. The drone crashed and then a bunch of other stuff happened. I won't go into details because it, I don't want to talk about it. But in the meantime, like, subscribe, and I will see you the next time. Bye! Let's try it again. Bye!